vain. Everything we do is vain. But amen. But we, but because of the resurrection, we have hope in Him. Amen. amen. I thank right. God for that. Uh, we're going to do one uh, now. This is a beautiful song. I, we, we just started doing this not too long ago. And uh, heard this on the radio. And I, I, I thought we immediately that this is one that we need to do. And uh, there, there's a precious lady in our church that I just loved growing up. And, and um, Alzheimer's and all that has uh, affected her. And, you know, she doesn't know who anyone is anymore. And I know my grandmother, before she passed away, was suffering with dementia and all that. And we, I know every family here has had somebody or has somebody, um, you know, in the family that, that suffers from that. And we think so many times how helpless and, and all that we are. But, you know, no matter what they may forget, God's never forgotten them. Amen. And, Amy, this is a beautiful song that just says, He will remember me. Y'all listen to Love as He sings it.
just got through singing uh, that song. He's the he's the baby of our group. Uh, that's Bubba Jones. He's a junior at McAdory. Uh, a senior at McAdory. That, that changes every year, doesn't it? So, uh, <laughs> we hope. <laughs> um, and then next to him is Crystal Ashworth. And uh, next to her is Alex Campbell. And then uh, playing the lead guitar back there is Dwayne Allen. And... Uh, Playing the bass is Brady Holly, and then my wife Allison playing the drums, and I'm I'm Brad. And again, we appreciate y'all letting us come out here uh, tonight. Uh, I told him it was a beautiful ride out here. It's about an hour, fifteen minutes, hour and a half, maybe if you drive like me, I guess. But uh, if you drive like him, an hour and fifteen minutes. If you drive like me, an hour and a half. And he's pulling a trailer too. So, uh, but anyway, uh, we're gonna see a few more for him. This world's wound so tight Something must happen The signs are in all that I see And it thrills my soul To think what is waiting That heaven's expecting me Oh, it's not
for a little bit. Uh, beautiful song. We just started singing this one not too long ago, but I mean, like we were saying a little uh, while ago with that other song, you know, we go through time and time again uh, things going on in life, and it just seems like that we try to handle it ourselves, knowing good and well just how helpless we are and just how incapable of handling things we are. And, you know, uh, so many times, and you've heard it said before, and it's the truth, we might go to the altar and, and lay it down with the Lord and then pick it up and take it back with us as soon as we leave. Or, or when we lay down on our pillows, uh, uh, praying that night before the Lord just to turn things over to Him, and then we wake up the next morning and just take it with us again. But, you know, this song just says, Jesus will do what you can't. And, you know, sometimes we just got to remember that faith in God I mean, it's a lot more important and can do a lot more things than anything we can ever do on our own. I mean, listen to this song, beautiful song.
pleasure to see you all here to sing the great gospel music today. Uh, especially the southern gospel, traditional gospel. You don't see a lot of that in today's churches. Young people tend to, to go down the more modern path. But, you know, it's really good to see this. And I'd like to see more of it because it's set, the next generation has to, has to carry on the tradition of the music that we grew up with. I mean, this music's been around a long time and it, uh, it should never fade away because it's uh, American music, traditional music, it's godly music, it's anointed music, and it's a music that should uh, really uh, be in our churches, be in our homes, be on the radio, but unfortunately you don't hear a, hear a lot of it today on TV and on the radio unless you tune into special channels. So, and this is a venue where uh, LGS Ministries wants to promote this traditional music, Southern Gospel, country gospel, bluegrass gospel, you know, music that we grew up with. And, you know, it's up to us to make it happen. It's up to us to keep it going. And uh, so that's why it's so important. Go to the website, lgsministries.com, and you'll get a lot of information. Become a sponsor to sponsor uh, local gospel uh, music singing right here in uh, Fayette County, Walker County, all the other counties. The goal is to put uh, a venue like this in every county in Alabama. And uh, I think that's pretty worthy. And so far it's in about three counties, but it can, it can grow. And it, it takes time, it takes some money too to do this. And to encourage young groups like uh, Crimson Stain. Uh, next, next week we're gonna have uh, the, uh, the Servants uh, Quartet from Ardmore, Tennessee. You know, they're, gonna, they're gonna be coming a long way to come to, to Barry, Alabama. So, you know, mark that on your calendar. And, and we wanna try to support these groups the best we can. So we're gonna take up an offering for them, a love offering before, and the Busbys are gonna come back and they're gonna do an in-between and then we'll have some more of the Crimson Stain. But I wanna mention that, you know, LGS Ministries is a ministry that, that wants to promote gospel music. And it's so important, just like uh, the PBS stations want to promote public broadcasting and creative music and arts, so does LGS Ministries. And it's so important that we support this. We support this type of music. Otherwise, try to find it on the radio. Going out. You know, it's hard, it's hard to find that on an FM station. You won't find it. So, you know, we have to keep this thing going. You keep it going in your churches. In the, if you don't have a a newsletter, pick one up in the, in the lobby, you can get on the mailing list. Inside the newsletter, there are several gospel groups with phone numbers. Have your church book them for a special occasion, or any occasion, make it make it a special occasion. Very good groups. I mean, these are, these are professional class groups. We've had groups.